Hey, how are you doing, Kevin Clark here? It's a privilege and honor to be serving you at such a time as this. Now, there's some great things waiting for all of us today, waiting to just literally fall on our lap. However, how we position ourselves is going to determine how that happens. If we don't put corresponding action on the very things that we expect, then it ain't going to happen. So what plans do you have in mind? Have you got a clear goal of the things that you are going to achieve today? And then if so, what steps are we taking in order for those things to be ticked off your list, so to speak? Now, since we've last spoken, I've been under some serious construction and it's been extremely uncomfortable. What I can also say is when you are going somewhere to happen, get ready because things can happen very quick to the point where you're like, wow. And based upon an experience that I had some years ago when I went to an internet marketing seminar and found myself in a position where I started to learn different things and as a result of that, build a business which grew really quick. Now, as a result of that growth happening really quick, I wasn't ready in my mind to handle the growth. The capacity was there, but the capacity wasn't exercised enough to handle everything that was about to come my way. And as a result of that, I went through an extremely challenging time. So I strongly encourage you right now, if you receive any messages from people in close proximity to you, inside of your groups, on your Facebook profile or on your YouTube account or on your Insta, whatever groups that you are in. If you've got people around you that are sending you information to help you grow, to help you plan, to help you become successful in the things that you are struggling to be successful in, then take that step, respond back, respond back if it's business and you're connected to somebody that deals with business strategy connect with them see how they can shift it to the next level if it's art if it's music because if you continue to do things the same way you're going to get the same results all the time and that's insane so well done on your achievements so far what I love about these messages is I'm speaking to myself as I'm putting these messages out there so I'm constantly challenging myself certain times you might think that you've overcome certain stuff or there might be things blocking you from becoming a better version of yourself you never know until you decide to step out to see where you really are and what shifts need to be changed or what shifts need to take place rather what changes need to take place Often time, we are connected to people to take us to that next level. However, if we're not aware and we're constantly making up these excuses, then we can find ourselves going through those three sixties time and time again. And then it's like one year, two year, three year, four year, five years, six years, into 10 years, I wish her, I could her, I should her. If only, if only, so check out the company that you keep in, the circles that you're around, who's speaking into your life, who's shaping your thinking. Faith comes by hearing, it comes through your, your eye gates, you listen with your eyes, you listen with your ears. And as those things come in, the form and shape. So be brutally honest, if you're not happy with the circles that you are, rather than whinge and complain, use that energy to position yourself in circles that will celebrate your life rather than pull you down. So I encourage you to continue to keep up the great work. You've made it this far. You're amazing. And I thank you for your support. I absolutely love my community so much. I've just gone through this awakening which has completely shattered my world. And as a result of that, <laughs> and that's due to certain belief sets and me doing some inner work. And, um, really discovering things about myself and being honest, operating in unconditional love and forgiveness 
operating in it, when you're actually walking that out, profound things take place. As a result of that, I find myself in such a place, a challenging place, like, whoa. And I tell you this as well, when you dare to go and be honest about who you truly are and what you are truly about, your external world, be ready for changes in your external world. There's going to be changes in your body, you know, how your body starts behaving as well. So, as we are continually growing and improving and shaping and becoming a better version of ourselves, enjoy the journey. Enjoy it. Go with the flow of it. Flow with it. Flow with the challenges. Flow with the changes. Just flow with it. Flow with it. And enjoy it. Celebrate your life. Celebrate your goals, celebrate your vision, celebrate your dreams. When you've got dreams and you're working towards, working and walking towards your dreams, you're literally watching your dreams unfold in front of your eyes. And the beautiful thing is, when you're connected to people that are really passionate about life, people that love yourself, people that are full of joy, fulfilled people, people that are loving, when you're around people like that and you're going through life, what happens is, the crab-like mentality is not there. You're constantly being pulled up, elevating, 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 growing. There's plenty of room up the top. So how wonderful is it to be around people that celebrate your life? I'm one of those people celebrating life with you. So I encourage you to continue to be the change that you want to see and live the dream. I love you so much. <laughs> Speak to you soon. That's it from me, Kevin Clark. God bless. Bye now.